Paul, welcome to Spenny Moor Town. How excited are you to get this move done? Yeah, look, obviously it's been in the in the pipeline for a week, a couple of weeks now, a week or so. Um, so yeah, to have it done's uh, sorry, relief really. It must give you a bit of confidence. The manager's obviously chased you for a little while. He, he really wanted to add you to your squad, and that can only give you a, a big boost. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, the gaffer's um, shown that he wants us here, um, which is always nice. And I think I've just got to got to repay him by performances on the pitch. Was it a move you were interested in immediately when you, you started sitting down and talking about and thinking about? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think spending more. I've played here a few times now. Um, good crowds, nice pitch, nice little ground. So yeah, looking forward to get going. And across the squad as well, you'll know there's a few familiar faces in there. If you haven't met them or played with them yourself, you've certainly played against them a few times, I imagine. Yeah, obviously Tommy Forbes, he's on loan here from Gateshead. Um, and then obviously Ramshaw and all the rest of them who, who have played against over the years. So... <laughs> Yeah, I'm looking forward to getting getting in with the group and then and seeing what's like. I know you're a northeast lad anyway, but I always say to new signs, it must feel a little bit daunting going into a completely new group of lads. Yeah, it's it's, it's something I've not done yet in in me in my career. So I've been a Gator for the past four years. So I think it's going to be it's obviously game straight away tomorrow as well, and then. But yeah, I'm sure the I'm sure the lads will make us feel welcome. <laughs> and, and and in terms of coming into this squad, what what kind of things are you going to bring for for spending more fans who haven't seen you in action before? What what's the uh, the main strengths of your game? Um, I like to run behind, um, get the get the defenders turned towards their own goal, and obviously putting the ball in the back of the net. I think that's the main thing. Is that's my main job, and that's what I, what I like doing the most. And scoring goals, obviously, a handy trait to have, and you did that quite well last season. I think you got the double figures at this level. Yeah, yeah, I got ten last year. Um, and then was out injured for the second half of the season. So, look, I'll try and add, add add more to my game and then also add the goals this year as well. As frustrating as it was to miss that time through injury, the, the rate at which you were scoring goals at this level must give you confidence that you can come in here and be you know, a real success. Yeah, yeah, look, I'm confident in my own abilities. When I'm on the pitch, I, I always feel like I'm going to score. Um, so it's just about bringing that to the table here and hopefully I, hopefully I score plenty. And, and obviously coming in, you know, to, to try and help the the other forward attacking players we've got at the club, the likes of Glenn Taylor, who you obviously know he's been around in the scene yeah. and scoring goals regularly. How excited are you to, to play alongside him and to complement what we already have at the club? Yeah, look, Glenn's unbelievable. I've played against him a few times now and obviously I think he's scored 20 plus for God knows how many years. So I think I can learn from Glenn a lot. Obviously he's scored numerous goals for the club. I think he scored his 150th. He did, yeah. I've seen, yeah. So yeah, to play alongside him would be good. Um, hopefully I can learn plenty from him as well. And, and it is relatively early in the season as well. The league table, it looks at first glance pretty bleak, but the, it's so congested that, you know, it just takes a little bit of momentum and it can quickly change, can't it? Yeah, yeah, look, there's plenty of games. It's a it's a, it's a a long season. Um, we're only early in. There's plenty plenty more games and plenty more points up for grabs, so I'm sure every time we go out there, we'll we'll be looking to get three points and hopefully it's, uh, it puts you in good stead at the end of the season. It's just about building that momentum, isn't it? Confidence is so huge in football. Yeah, obviously confidence, massive thing. Um in results bring confidence so we'll we'll try and get the results um i'll put 100 percent in every time i put the shirt on and then and see what it leads with and, and obviously you say you've been at gateshead for a reasonable amount of time now was it a difficult decision in one respect to, to leave gateshead yeah look there's some unbelievable people there they give us a, a good platform um to really put my name about um and yeah it's come with time now i've had to leave so Look, it's it, I've got to look forward now, and it's it's the way it's the way football works. So, I'm happy I'm happy about the decision I've made, um, and I'm sure I'm sure I'll be able to score some goals for for Spenny. And being a North East lad as well, obviously helps coming into a club. You know what the football means to people in this area. Yeah, it's yeah. it's you know it's it's almost like a religion, isn't it? Yeah, well, look, a lot of North East lads in the in the change room as well. So, it's what it's about. It's, it's North East based. It's a it's a good little club. So yeah, happy. <laughs>